apologies? You caught me in an unseemly position. I was so anxious for today that I got here bright and early, but the warm sun lulled me straight to sleep. But never fear, I'm wide awake now. And I, Faye, have gathered all sorts of exciting news for you. Well then, sit back, relax, and prepare for the latest information on the Fire Emblem Heroes game. It's time for Faye Channel. Let's get started. We'll start with this. Oh, Faye! Loki? What the fey? Loki will make an appearance as a mythic hero? And I'm told she'll be in her true form, dressed in white. But keep those feathers puffed. Loki is known as a god who grants pleasure to mortals and then lures them into chaos. I hope she's not thinking of doing anything too dastardly. At the start of her turn, mythic hero Loki can inflict nearby foes with Discord and Gravity using her B skill, Dazzling Discord, and her C skill, Divine Deceit. If her HP is at 25% or higher at the start of combat, her weapon skill, Supreme Toke, will increase her attack and resistance. Plus, her attack and resistance can increase by 20% of her resistance. These stats also increase when she is in combat with foes who've been inflicted with negative status sure, effects. Sure. All thanks to her A skill, attack resistance catch four, and that C skill. And when her special Glitter of Light activates, she prevents her target and nearby foes from counterattacking. Overall, she seems to be pretty good at using very dangerous Loki-like tactics, don't you think? The summoning event Mythic Heroes Loki begins on April 30th. Hmm. Loki seems like she has something to say. Uh huh? Yeah. Faye, what? Listen to this! If you merge Loki at least once, you can take on merged ordeals. Let's take a look at the heroic ordeal of a merged Loki trickster god. And here it is. If you clear this heroic ordeal, you can get 600 dragon flowers. And these dragon flowers will be specific to Loki's movement type of flying. Fey Fey! From now on, newly added legendary, mythic, and emblem heroes will have merged ordeals available if you merge them at least once. Complete these ordeals, and you can get a reward of 600 dragon flowers of the hero's movement type. I'm told that merged ordeals may be somewhat challenging. But who doesn't like a good challenge? I'll keep my feathers fluffed and ready to go. And next up... <gasps> Hooray! It's Golden Week events! There will be a series of Golden Week events starting on April 23rd. Here's some of them now. First up, the login bonus. If you log in for 10 days during the active period, you'll get these rewards. Next is Choose Your Legends Hero Fests. Each Hero Fest will feature heroes from the first seven Choose Your Legends events. During the Hero Fests, the five-star hero initial appearance rate will be set to 8%, including a five-star focus hero initial appearance rate of 5%. Fey Pass subscribers can summon a five-star focus hero of their choice after summoning 40 times or more during each summoning event. And they can do that up to four times per event. This is a great opportunity to add Choose Your Legends heroes as your allies. Next up, Celebratory Quests. These quests will be added alongside the Choose Your Legends Hero Fests I mentioned. Complete these quests and you can get a total of 21 first summon tickets to use on the Choose Your Legends summoning events. So don't let them pass you by. And that's all for Golden Week events. So exciting. Faye? <laughs> What 
What in the world is this place? What is this menacing presence? Loki? Is that you? Loki? Wait. <laughs> Rooker? There's Rooker? Oh my! Seems Loki wants to play a little trick on all you summoners. It's been a while since I've seen a Rooker Sieges event, but it's coming now, and with different rewards from usual. Wow! You can earn up to 1,000 of each type of dragon flower by playing in the event! Loki is sure making Golden Week events more exciting with these rewards! Don't miss your chance to get these rewards and power up your heroes! The next Rooker Sieges will start on April 24th. Get pumped! And make sure you participate in the first Rooker Sieges we've had in quite some time. Now that's all for the Golden Week events. Loki sure surprised me when she showed up there, but it was definitely a happy surprise, don't you think? Last, but never least... The next version update is coming! Hold on to your feathers, and I'll tell you about two things to look forward to in May's update. First, it's two Legendary and Mythic Hero remixes. Through the remixes, two heroes can gain an abundance of strength. This time, it's Sigurd and Byleth. Here are some details for you summoners. First is Sigurd. He will obtain a new skill, Holy Knight Aura 2. After combat in which he activates his special, he can increase his and his allies' attack, defense, and movement. Sigurd will also obtain Seal Defense 4. Next is Byleth. He will obtain a new skill, Sublime done. Heaven 2. His special will be easier to activate, and he'll do more damage to dragon and beast foes. You cannot stop Byleth will also time. obtain Attack Speed Oath 4. Now, let's talk weekly revivals. Until now, only two weekly revivals were held each week. But starting with the update, there will be three each week. With more summoning events, you can expect to see your favorite heroes in weekly revivals even sooner than before. Faye! That's all for today! With all the dragon flowers I'll be able to get from events and merged ordeals, I think my heroes will be all powered up in no time! Wow! I managed to get through all that without falling asleep! But now... Oh, hey, it's time to get back to my nap. <laughs> <laughs>